Hello everyone, welcome back to Insel Electronics. So in this episode, let's take a detailed look at this Sunma analog multimeter that I featured in one of my previous shorts episode. But specifically, we are going to modify this thing, uh, you know, to add up one more functionality to this. To be specific, this one, you can see it's a TREB model. So this is the, uh, the instruction model that came with it. So if I show you this, you can see there are one two three four five six variants of this particular thing available in the market and each one having different different features also so ours is this one 360 treb and uh, you can see it has the option for buzzer and no led indicator and these things are also not present which we don't care these two we don't care right now so what i'm going to do right now in this video or at least what i'm planning to do right now is to convert the TREB to the TREBL because we can add that LED indicator. You can see, so this will become TREBL without the 100 ohms range. So the main thing is that this PCB, they're making these different versions by keeping some things on DNP and mounting some other things and making the external hardware accordingly. The PCB remains the same across all these variants. So that gives us an option to add this LED somewhere in here. And if you're not familiar with this type of analog multimeters, I'll put some pictures on the screen right now so that in that you can see in these type of meters, usually there is a red LED on the top left corner, left to right corner. That is for the uh, continuity indication. So if I, if you look closely here, you can see there are two options. Right now it is in that uh, last continuity option. You can see C, O, and T, Y mentioned in here. There, continuity and buzzer. So, I'll put this in the buzzer mode right now and you can see if I put it in the buzzer mode it gives us uh, an audible indication that there is a continuity but if I change it to continuity mode which is right here if I showed it it's going to show the right now this is showing the uh, cable resistance that is around 2 to 3 ohms that's what this is showing because this is not the original probe this is just a, a probe that I put from the market so in the other multimeters, if it had that LED, if this was the TREBL, then that red LED that was supposed to be here will also lit in this condition. So that's what we are trying to make in this video. We'll add a red LED in this, so that in this mode, if you short to uh, these two, or if you are measuring continuity across two planes, this LED will, that LED should light up. And that's what we are planning to do in this. If you're asking me why am I doing this, it's just for the fun of doing it because you know there is an option that is available in here so we are going to make use of it because there is nothing to lose in doing that so let's open it and see what we can do inside all right so we have managed to open the outer casing and look at this you can see right here that the company has already provided the hole in the plastic casing for adding that led but there is no hole in here so we might have to make a drill hole there to uh, accommodate for that LED or otherwise I think I can put it inside here also this thing. So I'll try to do it somewhere where there is space or rather I will make a drill hole in here itself. But the main thing is that we need to remove these batteries and uh, we need to take out this PCB. So let's remove this PCB and let's see where we can solder that LED. Okay, so I made the proper connections. You can see I soldered it to these two positions right here. These are the colors that I used. You can pick any color of your choice, it doesn't matter. So now let's put it back together and uh, see what happens. Okay, so we have finally managed to keep the PCB back in its original position. Make sure that you put just enough pressure, otherwise this PCB can easily get damaged. It's very Thin, so be very careful when handling with this so I made this connection and I have attached an LED and this is a 5mm LED you know you will not find the things that you're looking for when you need them the most 
I have a 3mm red LED with me but I don't know where I kept it. So I just uh, for the testing purpose at least I just kept it like this. Now let's put the batteries in and see what happens. Mm, 9 volt plus minus 9 volt plus and uh, minus going in. Okay now carefully connecting it like that in the continuity mode itself not short anything now let's put it in the show uh, continuity mode itself and there you go see see it is working just fine now the only thing is that where shall i even attach this led here or shall i make a hole in here or i don't know i just need to find a spot to keep this led so what happens if i put it in the buzzer mode nothing in buzzer mode nothing happens in continuity mode you can see the LED just works fine so let me find a proper place for connecting this LED and I shall come back after that alright so we have managed to fix the LED in here to this point right here you can see I got glued it right there because that's the only spot I think it is worth attaching otherwise I needed really a hole and right now it's around 10 30 p.m. 10 30 11 30 p.m. in fact so I don't want to go out and in fact I cannot even go out to buy that 3mm LED so this is what I'm doing right now. So let me show you how it works once I close everything. So let me just shut this back case and uh, lock the screw because our work is almost over so we can close this with confidence. and. Uh, Probe is still in the continuity mode. If I short it, there you go. Mm, yeah, I'm happy with it. I just done it because I just want to do it from my curiosity. So that's it guys, I just wanted to show you that it is possible if you have uh, one of these, it is possible to make that modification and if you need an LED just follow what I did in this video and you can be creative on where you keep that LED uh, based on your requirement. So that's it for today's video guys, thank you for watching, see you with another video.